and she is a serial entrepreneur and an awesome mom mm -hmm. and she is doing some pretty cool stuff down here at the Innovation Center. Krista, what are you working on right now? Well, I'm the CEO of Ego Entertainment and Growth Opportunities, which is really cool because it combines my creative uh, kind of side of me with uh, an amazing entertainment lawyer, um, Jeremy C. Green, who's been around for a long time, and we're doing really cool things in the entertainment and with fast growth companies. Um, so, entertainment um, trusts, film fund administration, lots of cool branding and social media, and just really fun kind of consulting work in the entertainment and fast growth world. Very cool. Yeah. That is awesome. So our fans have a question for you. What inspires you? What what gives you that drive, that entrepreneur itch? You know, for me, um, it's really about um, leading a very intentional life. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, I previously lived in a big fancy house out in the <laughs> suburbs, and we very intentionally, uh, when we moved from Canada back to Las Vegas, moved our family into the Ogden um, because we really wanted our girls to grow up in an entrepreneurial environment. We have two little girls, Bella and Mia, that are four and five, and uh, so we're literally at the Ogden, constantly surrounded by innovation and entrepreneurs that are wildly inspiring. Uh, then I also co-work out of the Innovation Center. So for me, I just find being around other startup-minded people who are passionate about changing the world and doing things differently. I am a die-hard fan of the underdog and rebels, awesome. so I find entrepreneurs really fit that and that's what really inspires me. Very cool. So you're right in the middle of downtown right now. I'm sure you know a lot is going on down there. What is your favorite uh, thing that that's happening downtown with the project and everything. Well, as a mom, the thing that really excites me is the new education um, that they're doing, and I'm really excited. We just found out actually on Monday um, that our girls were both accepted into the Ninth Bridge School. Oh, yes. I think what Meg and her team are doing with Ninth Bridge is going to be yes. so amazing and so innovative for education. So we're really excited. You know, we do as much as we can in the community. Mm -hmm. um, our girls love First Friday, the fire breathing praying mantis. <laughs> um, and so, you know, I think the education is really what inspires me as a mom and, and just gets me really excited about the downtown project. Awesome. Yeah. And then and, um, a lot of entrepreneurs are struggling when they start up, whether it be capital, whether it just be lack of motivation, whether they're just going all different directions. What kind of advice would you give them? You know, I think the most important re thing for me and the reason I've been able to have such amazing opportunities come my way mm -hmm. is that I really sought out amazing entrepreneurs that frankly had been there, had done it longer, mm. had done it better than <laughs> I had done it at the time. Um, and I would really encourage people to ask for help. Um, you know, I very rarely will turn someone down when they say, can I have 30 minutes of your time? I'm struggling on how to close, how to sell, how do I go out and get business? And a lot of those guerrilla techniques, we all started from the bottom. Yeah. Um, so, you know, I think that is really powerful. Um, and there's so many opportunities. Reach out to the Entrepreneurs Organization, EO, um, the Downtown Project, YPO, the Young Presidents Organization here in Las Vegas. There's some amazing coaches and mentors in the business community that are passionate about helping other entrepreneurs. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for your time. Awesome. Thanks for having me. Uh, Thanks, downtown. Beat bump. Good. Good. Awesome. Was that great? Downtown project. Downtown project.